According to the Warren County Health Services, 143 residents of that county have been diagnosed since the outbreak began. Mark Mahalan is in Glens Falls to bring us the story of one of the people who was hospitalized and recovered from the virus. Well, good evening. In late March and early April, Peter Sayano was sick. He went from not knowing what was causing his incessant cough to fully recovering from coronavirus. Peter and Patty Sayano celebrated their 26th anniversary last week, and this year the Queensbury couple has a lot to celebrate. In late March, Peter went home from work with a bad cough that got worse each day. By the beginning of April, he was having trouble catching his breath. The coughing got out of hand and it was very rapid. Um, I, I never realized I could cough so many times in just a few seconds, which makes you gasp for air. Patty was taking care of him at home because the hospital was reserved for only the sickest. And with very few tests available, they didn't know for sure Peter had coronavirus. She bought a pulse oximeter to measure the oxygen saturation in his blood. When it was low, she got him to the hospital right away. When they took him out of my car, I said, I love you. When you live it and you wheeled away and you're not going to see him and he's in critical condition, a very frightening moment. Peter was groggy, but recalls being asked if he had a health care proxy or living will. That's when it hit me in the face. With no visitors allowed, Patty relied on updates from hospital staff and says they went above and beyond. Things improved rapidly. Peter responded well to hydroxychloroquine and other medicines and was able to walk out of the hospital just six days after being admitted. I couldn't believe he was healthier than he'd been in a couple of months. And to see that transformation happen in just a few days was, we call it a miracle and a blessing. And even the medical professionals had said how miraculous it was, how quickly he turned around. Peter says he plans to donate his plasma so that others fighting coronavirus might fully recover like he did. Reporting in Glens Falls, Mark Mulholland, News Channel 13. Back to you.